Saint Etienne's home fixture with Angers was delayed after supporters angry with former Leicester City boss Claude Puel threw flares onto the pitch, burning a hole in one of the goal nets. French football descended into farce once again on Friday night as angry fans launched flares onto the pitch and swamped a stadium in thick smoke. Saint Etienne's home fixture with Angers was delayed by more than an hour as supporters vented their fury at manager Claude Puel. Fans are furious at the club's current position in the League One table. Les Verts are one of the grand old names of French football, having won the country's top flight title a record ten times, putting them one ahead of Marseille and Paris Saint Germain. But this season has not started well for Saint Etienne, and the club are rock bottom of the table with just four points and no wins from their opening ten matches. Supporters have seen enough and decided to protest against the current regime before Saint Etienne's home game with Angers on Friday night. As the teams made their way out onto the pitch ahead of kickoff, flares rained down from the stand behind the goal, covering the stadium in a thick layer of smoke. Footage showed home supporters racing down to the front of the stand to launch their pyrotechnics, some of which appeared to make contact with the goal net, burning a hole in it. Following almost an hour delay, the game eventually kicked off just before 9 p.m. UK time. The scenes at Stade Geoffroy Gwitchard follow similar incidents that have cast a shadow over French football in recent months. Play had to be stopped during Marseille clash with Galatasaray in the Europa League earlier this month while fans threw flares at each other. That followed an even worse incident in their League One clash with Nice last month. Former West Ham star Dimitri Payet was hit by a bottle thrown from the Nice end, which the Frenchman promptly threw back, almost sparking disgraceful scenes.